Hello guys and welcome to Python Programming Tutorials by Amuls Academy. Today in this tutorial we are discussing about how to print stars in alphabetical I shape. And this code is also similar to the previous pattern program. So let's begin with the code. Here is the output and we can see stars in different row and column. To print star in different row and column we need to use for loops. So here first we can see two for loop first for loop is to print the stars in the row and the second for loop is to print stars in the column and here row is a variable name and call is a variable name and we are using range function in the output we can see seven rows and five columns that's why i'll mention range as seven and the, in the inner for loop I'll mention range as 5. This means range is from 0 to 7 it will give output as 0 1 2 3 4 5 6 and inside that we can see another for loop it is to print stars in the column and here range is from 0 to 5 it will give output as 0 1 2 3 4 okay. Inside that for loop we can see if else conditional statement that is we need to print stars in some particular pattern for that we need condition that's why we are using if else conditional statement so here after if we need to mention the condition that is in which row and column we want to print star okay first we'll start with the column if we see the output in the column 2 we want to print star in each row right that is row 0 1 2 3 4 5 6 we want star so my first condition will be I'll check whether column is equal to equal to 2. If it is true then I want to print star. Okay. This is my first condition. Next I'll take logical or operator. In the logical or if any one of the input is true then output will be true. That is if any one of this condition will be true then it will print star. That's why I'm taking logical or here. We'll move to the next condition. We are done with the column so next we will go to the row and here we can see at the row 0 and row 6 we want to print star and at that time column should not be 2 because we already printed this star right. My next condition will be I will check whether row is equal to equal to 0 or row is equal to equal to 6. If it is true, column should be not equal to 2. Okay, this is my second condition where I am checking whether row is equal to 0 or 6. If it is true, then at that time column should not be 2. And here I used logical AND operator. And in the case of logical AND, if the both the inputs are true then only output will be true that is to print star if this is true this must be true okay so next colon and inside that if condition we are printing star so print star end empty string it's because here in the print by default end value will be slash n but here in our output after printing one star, I want another star immediately after that. That's why I mentioned empty string here, right? And next here we can see else part. That is if this condition become false, then control goes to the else part and it will print space. Here we can see at the row 1 and column 0 or row 1 column 1, we can see space, right? It's because of this print end space. Next, inside the first for loop, we are using print. That is, after printing stars in one row, we want control go to the next line. So, for that, we are using this print. Okay. So, now we are done with our code. So, I need to save this and run this. And here we can see I. That's it for now. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe my channel. I'll meet you in next class. Till then, take care.